Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is your first time stopping by. Welcome. If you've been here before, thank you for coming back. And in today's video, I want to show you a pair of Jordans that happens to be a 10 retro. It's actually my favorite Jordan 10 that has released. It has the theme built around the home of New York City, which is where I'm from. And because of that, it happened to appeal to me. I ended up picking them up and was surprised that I liked them more in hand than I thought I would. And as you can see, it is a size 13 Air Jordan 10 Retro, 30th. Color is dust, metallic gold, black, retro. And these were released in February of 2015. And what we have here is the Jordan 10 30th anniversary, what they be called the Lady Liberty. And as you can see, they used a metallic silver kind of speckle up here with the black on the midsole and the black across the upper over here. And the leather on here actually is really nice. The material is really nice on these. And just to jump right into the start, I purchased these off of StockX a while ago and actually got them for about 130 bucks. And that is 60 under retail. So I can't be happier with my purchase. And as you can see, the metallic silver and the black would represent what they would say the cracked and crackled uh, concrete of the streets of New York. And then on the bottom, you have the teal. And on the inside, you have the teal with the 30th anniversary logo there. And then you have this multicolor Air Jordan collection logo under the tongue. And the teal represents the Statue of Liberty. And in case some of you have never had a pair of Jordan 10s before, on the bottom it has his accolades going from when he started as a rookie in 85 all the way up to when this shoe was released. So you got 85 rookie year, 86 he had 63 points, scoring title in 87, dunk champ 88, all defense in 89, score 69 points in 90, MVP championship 91, 92, 93, and 94 is when this came out and beyond. I think they did really good with these. I like the shoe a lot. You got the gold jump man on the back. Pull tab right there in black. You got a very subtle kind of speckle on the paint there on the lower part of the um, outsole or maybe that's a midsole right there. Eh, that's probably the outsole. We won't get technical. There's a look at the toe cap with the speckle there. Your lace system across the tongue. And then you've got your Air Jordan 23 on the tongue. And yeah, I really like these. My favorite Jordan 10 actually to date. Um, the Bulls over Broadway are cool, but they're just too much red for me. Um, I really do like the NYCs. I have those as well. They're mostly all black, though, on the upper with a little bit of hints of gold. So they're very subtle. There's not too much story behind them besides the nyc on it that's my home and besides that you have other things like the chicago's which were pretty cool representative chicago's flag but i thought with the colorway here was unique the anniversary date from 1985 to 2015 30 years of jordan and i just thought it was one of those things that because it represented the story of jordan brand and their anniversary and also represented the place where i'm from it appealed to me. So I picked them up. Glad to have them in my collection. I will never sell these. They'll either stay clean or I'll eventually just suck up the guts and just beat them into the ground and just wear them out. But other than that, I just wanted to show you the guys real quick. My favorite Jordan 10. Let me know what you think about these. Do you have a pair? Have you ever seen these before? Do you like them? Do you hate them? Let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, please drop a like. Please subscribe. Helps the channel grow. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. All right. Have a good day. Bye.